Hey, it's good to see you. Today we are in Asheboro, North Carolina at the Randolph Mall. It is really exciting. There's a Five Below over there and a Books A Million over there. I don't know what's inside. I haven't been in this mall in a while, so let's go find out. <laughs> well, you come in and there's a Jade Express over there. There's a lot of empty storefronts in here. And it's really actually kind of sad because I remember coming here as a young person and uh, this mall opened in 1982. And honestly now, all I'm seeing in here are mall walkers. There is a shoe show over there and look, you can do coin operated stuff. Like you can get on this little Clifford right here. You can ride on Clifford. You can get in a little squat space shuttle. Well, that's pretty cool. I don't know how, how do you get in it? Oh, you, you step into it and you get a, a good case of Ebola. Oh, there's a dragon. Look, somebody left a toy. There's a little toy dragon sitting there. <laughs> I'll leave it alone. So there's a shoe show here. Um, an Aeropostale factory store. I thought they closed. Why was I thinking they closed? I guess I'm wrong about that. And then over here, Lord, we don't, okay, you know what? This is the backside of Five Below. All these people walking around in here, I think they're pretty much all mall walkers. Oh, and also, um, also, because Ashboro is the home of the North Carolina Zoo, you're gonna see pictures of stuff at the zoo. That's, that is the Pisgah Covered Bridge, um, which is in Randolph County, which is where we are. Um, we celebrate our community, Ashboro's history and continued growth with displays of photographs representing the past, present, and future of our community. We are Ashboro. There's the downtown farmer's market sign. Oh, here's one of the corn mazes. There's the downtown district of Ashboro. Yeah. Oh, let's see. We'll come down here and see what we can find. Oh, wow, look at that. What is that? That must be, it looks like a museum or something, but I'm not familiar with that. Oh, here's the Sunset Theater. Now, I know where that is. That's headed downtown. The Sunset Theater. Motorcycles. They have uh, Cox Harley Davidson is here. You can buy you a Harley. And we have, oh, Richard Petty. Richard Petty lives in um, Randolph County. I actually, uh, well, I didn't, meet, you know, like formally meet him, but when I worked at Moses Cone Hospital, he came in when his mother was there. Back when she was still alive, she, uh, she had to come in and have surgery or something, and he stopped by the pharmacy where I was working to ask for directions to her room. That was bizarre <laughs> to turn around, and he's standing right there in the window like, oh, my God. <laughs> that was crazy. Um, okay, anyway. Well, you can get accessories. I guess that's phone accessories. There is a Rue 21 over here with clearance up to 70% off. I can't really go into any of these stores because they all play a loud music. Check out that hoodie though. That's pretty interesting. It has roses on the side of the sleeve there. That's nice, I kinda like that. Um, we have some lovely foliage in the middle of the floor and there's a skylight up there. Um, if you like tours of dying malls, which I would I would probably say this is a, I think this would qualify as a dying mall, unfortunately. These floors have not changed since this place was built in 1982. There's a channel called, there's a K Jewelers, this is Dan Bale, and he does, um, he does walkthroughs of dying and dead malls like this all over the country, and it's, it's fascinating. Hey, look, it's a little island of doohickeys. 
Look, you can get little toys, banana candy, gumballs. Oh, little mini sticky hands. Watermelon flavor. You can find out if you're going to heaven or not. There's been a Jehovah's Witness here. You can find out, because that little thing's going to take. Rascal's Candy. Mike and Ike's. Very cherry bubblegum. Hot tamales. And you can get your change here. Oh God, they have jelly bracelets. <laughs> Grape gum. Skittles. Tropical fruit gum. Pucker ups. Blueberry. Oh, you can get a little ring too. And M and oh, they have M and M's candy. All kinds of stuff. Oh, and look, they have one of those little photo booths. You can you can come over here and you can get your little picture made in here. See, for five dollars, you can make a picture. Here's another empty, another empty storefront. Another empty storefront. These have different gates on them. Check it out. There's, wow, it's big in there actually. It's really big. This whole little cul-de-sac down here is empty. There's, there's nothing down here. Except my walkers. This is a pretty big, this is a good size store right here. Check it out. Look at that. There's a lot of space in there. Pretty nice. Okay. So what is, okay, so this is K Jewelers. K Jewelers is still here. They do have a little play area over here for kids. Look at this big skylight here, wow. That's pretty, um, that's pretty awesome. But yeah, Dan, Dan Bell does walkthroughs and Abandoned malls, dead malls, dying malls. He, um, actually, I think he's, uh, I, I'm not, I'm not ratting on him, but he may have broken into a couple to make videos. <laughs> One of them, he got escorted out by the police. Here's Bird's Flower Shop. It looks like they're not open right now. Oh, they have Claire's. Y'all remember Claire's? Lord have mercy. You know, I think this is where I got my ears pierced when I was 12. It might have been here. I don't remember. Well, that whatever that was is gone. I think that was the limited. And in there, you can get your hair cut. You can pay to get a little massage right here. Now, down here, this I think this used to be an entrance to Dillard's. I could be wrong. There used to be a Dillard's here. It's not here anymore. There's a Belks here, but no Dillard's anymore. This is really sad, honestly. This is sad. The skylights are nice, though. Look at that. And the plants are still in good shape. They look pretty good. So you just have this little brick walkway just going right through here, and that would have taken you straight into Dillard's. Yeah, there's really... Now, mind you, it is early in the morning. Holy Joe. <laughs> Holy... Oh, it's a... It's like a God comic or something. You can get your nails done, too. There is little nails. But the plants actually don't look too bad. Sometimes you come into these dying malls and the plants are not in a very good shape. So yeah, you could come here and get your nails done. It's um, the ceiling tiles. Well, I don't see any water damage, but they do. Some of them have holes in them. That's very unfortunate. So yeah, it is early. It's, it's kind of early. They haven't been open long, so. I don't think it's this way all the time. I mean, my people are at work. Look at this big open area. The carpet's all stained. Look at it. Dang. I bet this carpet has been here as long as this establishment has been open. Oh, you can get Gorilla Pizza. 
at an Italian restaurant here at the mall. Gorilla, I don't even know where that is. That's, um, that's bizarre. I haven't seen Gorilla Pizza. Maybe we haven't gotten to that part. We do have a Bath and Body Works in here. They, well, they're everywhere. I mean, it doesn't even matter. Any mall you go to, <laughs> if, there's, if there's no Bath and Body Works, they're already screwed. I'm not gonna go in there. Because every, well, the music is loud enough out here. I, I don't want a copyright ding, so I keep moving. Okay, there's Belks down there. We didn't go down there. Maybe Gorilla Pizza. No, we went down there. No, we didn't. No, we didn't. We went the other way. So you have another big open area here with some more nice skylights. Boy, they like their skylights here. A little empty kiosk. We're back at Clifford in the space shuttle and shoe show. Hey, there's a mullet, look. I spotted a mullet. All right, sorry, I almost, I almost stopped. I almost stopped. American Eagle Outfitters. Definitely can't go in there. The music is always loud in there. And another little kiosk of gum and candy. Ooh, suits to impress. There's a GNC. Urban trends, men's, big men's, girls and boys. Oh my God, Maurice's is still here. Lord, I used to come in here when I was in high school. I did, a lot of my fashions in high school came from Maurice's. I figured they'd be long gone, but they're still here. We have a shoe department encore. That's big, it goes all the way around here. I remember one time, they did a fashion show right here back in the 80s. Oh, there's an arcade. It's called Time Out. They even have an American Idol machine. Look. <laughs> American Idol. How about that? Awesome. A lot of games. But no, they did a, um, I think it was Belks. They did a fashion show right here. And they were doing prom dresses. It was, it was prom season, and they had it all set up to do just prom dresses. Oh, you can't get in this way. Now, why would they have this closed? It seems to me like they would want you to be able to get in, but we're locked out of Belks. We can't go there. So close, yet so far. Wow. So this is Randolph Mall in all its shining glory. <laughs> it's it's kind of sad, actually. But you know, there aren't many malls that are doing well. There are a lot of malls that have already closed all over the place. Now we do have Four Seasons Mall in Greensboro. I don't know how it's doing. I don't ever go there, but yeah. I, I'm actually really tickled to see that Maurice's is still here. <laughs> Oh my god, I used, I did. I would come up here and, I would come up here and buy stuff. Oh my god. That's, that's awesome. <laughs> that is so awesome. But yeah, I ought to take you to Four Seasons Mall sometime. I need to do that. Definitely going to do that. But, uh, I thought while I was in Ashboro, I would pop in here and let you take a look around the place and see what you think. So it's really quiet here. Just, just the Walmart, the wall, the, the, I guess I said Walmarters, the mall walkers. Probably some Walmarters too. Oh, there was a picture people. They used to do family portraits and stuff. So there you have it. But thank you so much for hanging out with me and walking around to see the Randolph Mall. I really hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you again really soon.